Hello and welcome. Today we're going to talk about GeForce Now, which is another cloud-based gaming service developed by NVIDIA, which allows users to play PC games on almost any device, including laptop, desktops, Macs, Android phones, tablets and TVs. And this service uses remote servers with high-end gaming hand hardware to stream games to users, enabling them to play games that their devices would not normally be capable of running. Baseline, this is what is characteristic of every cloud gaming for now. To use GeForce Now, uh, you need to sign up for a free or paid subscription. You can either install the GeForce Now app on your device or use the uh, browser site. Once you are connected, you can access a library of over 1500 games so far. You can add your own game library from uh, either Ubisoft Connect, Epic Game Store or Steam. And you can stream your games to, uh, from the cloud. One of the key benefits of GeForce Now is that it eliminates the need for users to have high-end gaming hardware to enjoy PC gaming. Instead, the service enables you to play games on devices that you already own, and it handles all of the heavy lifting in terms of processing power and graphics. GeForce Now also offers a range of other features, including the ability to save game progress on to the cloud, play games with friends in multiplayer mode, and access uh, special discounts and exclusive game releases. Overall, the service provides a convenient and affordable way for gamers to enjoy high-quality PC gaming on a wide range of devices. So, right now, if you want to play it in the browser, the GeForce Now sub officially supports uh, Google Chrome version 89 or higher, Microsoft Edge uh, version 89 or higher, Safari version 14 or higher on macOS and Big Sur uh, 11.0 or later. You can launch and play games of GeForce Now directly from this web browser without the need to download any additional software, so it's a plus. But it's important to note that some browser extensions or settings may interfere with the service, so it is recommended to disable any ad blockers, VPNs or the similar software before using the GeForce Now on a web browser. On the other hand, the GeForce Now app is an application, It's a, of course it's developed by NVIDIA, it's a very light application that allows you to connect directly to access the GeForce Now cloud gaming service on your device. Uh, the app is available for Windows, macOS, Android and NVIDIA Shield TV devices. The app offers an easy to use interface that allows users to log in into their account, browse the game library and launch the games with just a few clicks. It's very clear. UI, it's intuitive, it's, it's easy to connect your account to Ubisoft, Epic Games, and Steam. It also provides various customization options such as adjusting the streaming quality, uh, audio out output and graphic settings. One of the key, key features of the GeForce Now app is its ability to sync your game libraries across multiple devices. If that means if you own a game on your PC, you can access it on your phone or tablet by the app without needing to purchase a separate copy, which is starting to be an issue, especially for re releases of the game for several devices. Like we have course with Skyrim. I'm not going to talk about Skyrim. The app also offers additional features such as game streaming optimization, which helps to ensure the best possible streaming quality based on your network and device specifications. Uh, you can also take advantage of the app's integration with social pro platforms like Twitch and Discord, uh, enabling them to stream your gameplay and connect with other players. And overall, the app provides a convenient and fr user-friendly way to, for gamers to access the GeForce Now Cloud Gaming, on your device for me i'm using i'm usually using mozilla firefox as a browser so i had to download the app rather than getting google chrome separately especially for this let's see let's go to the membership options the basic one is a free membership plan that allows you to access the service and play games up for one hour at a time 
After an hour, you will need to log out and log back in to continue playing. Uh, the free membership plan also limits the resolution of the game streaming to 1080p and restricts access to certain games. Users with free membership can access the full library of games available on the service, but may experience longer wait times when queuing to start a game compared to paid members. Additionally, free members are not able to use ray tracing, a graphics technology that enhances the visual quality of certain games. Which doesn't always work, like with Callisto Protocol, but let's not get into that. Uh, while the free membership plan is a good option to, for trying out the service or playing casual games, users who want to play for longer periods or, of time or access higher quality graphics may want to consider upgrading to a paid membership plan. The priority membership plan uh, provides access to full library of game on the service with a six hour limit on the game sessions you can also get priority access to game servers which can help reduce wait times when starting a game and the ability to use ray tracing and the on the other hand the ultimate the membership plan offers you all the benefits of the priority membership plan as well as additional features such as extended session lengths up to eight hours access to exclusive in-game content and early access to some new games releases. Ultimate members may also get access to the RTX ON feature, which enables them to play games with real-time ray tracing and AI-based upscaling. And all the both priority and ultimate membership plans allow users to sync their game libraries across multiple devices and offer a seamless and high-quality gaming experience on a wide range of devices, including laptops, desktops, Macs, Android phones, tablets, and TVs. Over and overall, the paid membership plans provide a more premium and unrestricted gaming experience compared to the free membership plan, with additional features and benefits to enhance the overall gaming experience. So I would advise you to check the GeForce Now with the free membership, it do, you don't have to put any payment bef uh, payment method beforehand like some of the streaming uh, services do. You just choose free membership. You create an account or log in to your existing GeForce account. And you just can get right into the game without anything else. You can try so three demos that they have uh, available right now there are 18 free demos that you can check out when you're through trying the service so that's it for the GeForce now i hope that the information i gathered is enough for you if you have any more questions feel free to ask them in the comments i'll try to look into the matter closer if you need, still need some information and uh, hopefully we'll see you when we will be checking it the service in game so thank you very much stay alive and see you soon bye